Hello everyone and welcome back to Civilization 5. My name is Morse Conceptus and today we're continuing our conquest as Oda, the ruler of Japan. This is where we left off last time. I'm sorry that I haven't been posting uh, videos lately. I was out of town and right now I'm back and I'm continuing posting the video videos and uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy. And uh, this is where we left off last time building up a bunch of buildings to increase our gold intake and return our happy happy people to uh, being more a lot more happy um, and so far I mean we just created the oh he smokes uh, we just created the settler and he's we're gonna move him here and create this island as our own and I brought a frigate here to destroy the barbaric barbaric movement Look at them. They're so barbaric. And hopefully I can crush their empire right there with one frigate. Hopefully no other frigates are needed. And we have a Persian, Persian, Persian. Where did the Persian come from? Uh, with the pointy sticks and I <laughs> people with the pointy sticks and we're the third and I always thought that we were the first ones but I'm guessing all right I'm just looking closely at this guy because he doesn't have as big army as we do so that indicates to me that they're weak and we will take advantage of that once we have reached our um, science for the for our great artillery piece that we're so trying so hard to get to all right so we haven't had any trouble with religion lately and I'm just gonna take a look quick peek at what's going on it's only 13 cities, and there are a lot more cities, such as, not cities, but um, empires that have a lot more. And hopefully, we can fix that by spreading out our religion. So, let's see. Okay. I'm going to create a, not create, but I'm going to pur purchase, purchase a missionary but uh, how can I send it to them without them being never mind I guess I'll wait until the, uh, the right moment when I will attack them and basically I'll keep it uh, spreading my religion that way it's one way to spread um, okay the Washington seems to have and um, what in the world is the Persian Empire doing here Either it's really being have a very unwelcomed um, their ship movement. It seems very. It seems disturbing. It seems very disturbing, actually. Uh, let's see. Who is my friend? Friendly. I'm gonna move up here and all right so let's destroy one of the troops enemy troops and art funding and world religion Buddhism uh, no Shinto that's what it needs to be okay so I mean as we can see there's not much not many parts of land that we need to explore anymore I'm gonna pull my um, samurai back because uh, by the way it looks like it, it's very tiny, very weird, very tiny uh, looking type of continent, really. And at the moment right now, I am finishing to explore right here, this little piece. I don't know why I might think doesn't want to move. Okay, now it's moving. And uh, I'll just discover what is uh, hidden here. And I'll, let me take a look at what we actually have in our technology tree 
so we're almost done with this okay so once I'm done with the Mita Luger Lurgi can't even pronounce it I'll do the rifling and slowly I will uh, upgrade my units and I will get start working on dynamite see the dynamite will take the longest and once I reach the dynamite I need to build one more cannon so I think I have enough time to build a cannon I feel like it's a lot cheaper and faster to build a cannon um, than to purchase an artillery piece later on because I don't know I just had a bad bad uh, experience with that and we have Shishane frigates everywhere here and that makes me wonder if they are there just passing by or just stationed there on purpose but I do wanna grab and make a few more frigates so I can defend my trade system here which I just put two one here and a few over here just in case they try something funny because I mean they've done funny things in the past and as we as you remember it didn't work out so well for either sides oh look at this if this guy defeats me the thing is what privateer does they only fight melee but they can capture your ship and when they do it's like basically being a, a pirate they capture a ship and that's it you're done uh, let me see we will keep that as we're not gonna settle here because we need that production we have plenty of food I'm not worried about the food but I will keep this clear as well so I'm not worried about this two apples over there so I'll find the city right here and I'll move this guy over here and as I always pick monument and library walls shrine barracks and granary pretty much that's that's the, that's what I tried to build in the beginning as you guys have noticed and follow along um, I need to get a troop over here let me see can I get a soldier over there Egypt and Carthage now friends okay that's great I guess Denmark and uh, we had something to do with the Denmark and now they have announced so as you can see right now we're having trouble with friends and all but I mean as long as it doesn't come here to my continent I really don't you know pay much attention to it let's see get this guy set up and the ship privateer is gone what is going on all right I have a samurai here I think I will let me get let me purchase them do I really want to purchase can I just swim over there you know what I'm gonna move move my guy over here my samurai and hopefully that will work out come on okay there's some iron here and nobody is doing anything about it but it's okay as long as nobody has it in the way of uh, trespassing oh yeah because of my samurai that's why they're mad they have well pearl well no wonder you guys are not happy look at this our empire looks weird looks like a Y ideology adopted Korea has adopted ideology I don't know why they want to be so ideal but whatever we're gonna convert everybody all right so Hermes truffles and salt let me go back in that DLC hopefully I can uh, fix that deal again with uh, truffles and get salt back in a way and uh, after I do all this next please nope nobody wants to be next that's okay um, I don't want to pull my troop troop over there yet or maybe I should hopefully I won't get shoot I need to do that 
hopefully I, I can get this ship over here, frigate, and he will cross safely because there is a privateer somewhere around here. And we don't want that, you know, we don't want the privateer to kill our settler because it did take us time and money and production to build. And you guys were watching almost, what, <laughs> one, two episodes until it was built and stuff. So, yeah, gold. See, that's a deal that I would take. And I accept it. All right, now I need to get to world diplomacy overview overview and let's see can i spot somebody who doesn't need something mm. so far i haven't seen nope everything is taken it's like they don't want me to trade with them i'm trying to be friendly with them you know i'm trying all right let's see what they find out here uh no, I don't want the Buddhism to be a world religion. And I'm going to commit delegate to that. Stand by over here. Next. And we might not even need a samurai for this. Okay, this guy is out of turns. So let's hit next and see what will happen. Plus one. Byzantium is my friend, that's why they can fix it. Okay, I gotcha. So Byzantium is holding down two of the capitals, their own and the Thebes, Thebes the, um, the G Egyptian capital. So, hmm, it's not bad really, pretty good. I mean, I haven't done that, or have I? Yes, I have. The, what you might call it, the Sweden. Alright, so we do see some actions over here. Something's going on with the troops enemy troops they're doing they look funky uh was not passed of course you wouldn't only two people would say yay and they have seven nay 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 yay 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 was not passed okay well i definitely don't want buddhism because then just would be the whole purpose of building uh, uh making a shinto shrines and stuff so it's like what's the point you know so all right, we have one person happy. What is wrong with these people, really? All right, so I want you to build a, not privateer, because see, privateer can specialize in attack coastal cities to earn gold and capture the enemy ships. But we don't want that. We want more of these and one of that sucker right there. And I think I'll do the same thing for this guy, just in case. Uh, click next. And where do we build this guy uh, our proposal for the world was defeated at the hands of your delegates do not expect our delegations to support your interest in the future well i'm sorry if your delegation your position was so weak that it failed because i said no and i only hold two delegates uh, you're a tiny empire you just bluntly suck if you if your empire crumbles by such a uh, such by little delegations like mine so all right enough of that we will let's see where can i settle this guy why is it taking so long all right where can i settle this guy i do not i'll put him right here it will be a nice circle in a way and they have crab we want crab boy i know we have crab but that sounds good right now crab meat all right, off topic. Um, going back to this <laughs> settling. If I place this guy right here, it will cover up all the tiles around him. So, we should focus on... I will leave a ship here, frigate here, because it will play as a defense in case somebody tries something very stupid. And uh, that does tend to happen a lot in this game. Especially from very aggressive neighbors all right um we're almost done with the with the research of this and i'm not even going to try and pronounce it yes the empires 
And okay, and I have an extra spy. That is great. And uh, we're gonna pull back the what you might call it. The, and we're gonna settle him right here. That will hopefully help us. Let's build up the monument for this guy. Uh, almost pretty much the same thing. Library, shrine, barracks, granary, and a wall. And I will leave my ship over here. Heal him up. And let's see what can I do with my... Where do I want to send this spy? You know what? I will send him to a Byzantium Empire. Since... And I won't send him as a spy, I'll send him as a, hello, Constantinople, okay, that's what I was looking for. I'm going to move to Constantinople, and as a diplomat, not as a spy, spies get killed uh, as a diplomat. If you go as a diplomat, it's a lot safer for you there, as a diplomat. And, uh, alright, let's build a musky man. Musky man. Alright, uh, let me check before we do anything else before I hit that uh, arsenal yes it doesn't really give us all right let me do that too just in case all right and we have discovered or have seen everything that our um, continent can give so I'm gonna send this caravel all the way there because Oh, look, they're so weak. They came and killed the barbarian. Because that's what I want to do with this guy. And what's going on? Lancer. Why would I want Lancer? But that's just what I guess I'm going to do before I can switch to a Gutling gun, I think. All right. And click next. Then we have six unhappy people. Why in the world are you unhappy people? You have fish. Oh. This reminds me of fish. Let me bring my summer over here. Build a fishing vessel and pull him back all the Sir, way there. No, I refuse. Horses for whatever they were asking. Ivory? No, that does not sound good to me. All right, 100 and... See, 23 gold. But that's just one price. I want... Per turn... I want nine. Oh, I refuse. That's the case. Friends, friendship didn't work out so well, right? See, now this is seven is the lowest I can go. And plus, he gave me some uh, extra gold. Hey, I'll take this. But why I wanted her nine? Because it seemed like she could, she could have done it. She has enough money, but she chose not to. And I mean, I have enough money, but as you can see, I'm a gold hogger right here. Look at that. So, let's finish up this trade route. We've got a Lancer over there, a Lancer over here, and another one. And let me, let me, let me look. Nope, I don't see any more. That needs to be. And I'm thinking I'll end the episode here, guys. I appreciate you guys watching. Hopefully you liked. Hopefully it was as enjoyable as it is for me to make the videos. And I do have a Twitter, so please follow me uh, on it. It's in the description below. And I hope you guys are having and will have a great day.